Welcome to this new video. What you're seeing here is a self-sustaining mini ecosystem, a whole piece of nature with some rescued inhabitants. This is the initial tiny sanctuary, a fully closed bioactive terrarium where I put the isopods I found in my house during winter. Usually I release them outside, but when the temperature is below zero, it's condemning them to a certain death. So I made this jar last year to save them, and while doing some maintenance today, I decided to present it to you. So what's happening here? The jar contains tropical plants thriving in high humidity environments. Here I've put a ficus, some phytonia, and different types of moss. Initially, the only inhabitants were springtails, those little critters that eat mold and keep the terrarium clean. But then I start rescuing those little guys, saving them of an inevitable death, my house being way too dry for them to breath. Now look at them living happily their little lives. Some of those little ones would never have been born outside. In this ecosystem, every element plays a vital role. Plants provide oxygen and regulate moisture, while isopods help decompose organic debris, enriching the soil. This natural cycle allows the ecosystem to regulate itself, requiring very little human intervention. Honestly, I only add a bit of water every few months and sometimes I drop a bit of vegetable for the little guys. An important note if you want to start isopods keeping, a closed terrarium is not ideal. I will even say it's the worst kind of environment for a thriving colony. To prevent overpopulation, you need to reduce protein intake to the minimum that will slow down the reproduction. And most importantly, not every species will survive in a very high humidity environment. I will show you in a future video how to make a perfect environment for them. But still, if you're interested in isopods keeping, doing the same with local species will be a good start. If you have any questions, ask them in the comments section, I'll happily help you. Thank you for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video.